So now our challenge is to convince the rest of the world of the advantages of this approach. This coming October, the, I'm sorry, next October, a year from now, the United States will participate in the ITU World Conference on International Telecommunications. This treaty negotiation will conduct a review of the international telecommunication regulations, which are the general principles which relate to the provision and operation of international telecommunication services. We can expect that some states will attempt to rewrite the ITRs in a manner that would establish more direct governmental control of the internet and cybersecurity. These are the countries that we, including all of you in this room, must reach to promote the multi-stakeholder model, and our work must begin right away. The IGF meetings upcoming in Nairobi in September will provide us all with an excellent opportunity to get started on this important task. I will attend and will use speaking opportunities both at the IGF and at the government of Kenya's ministerial meeting to explain why we support multi-stakeholder internet governance and why it is so valuable to preserving and enhancing a dynamic internet. Most importantly, we'll talk about how it can be most useful in countries with little tradition of employing it. 